I tried something new. Didn't know you could do this. So, you know, we're on ChatGPT 5. Mm-hmm. And I don't know if there's, I think there's more than one version of 5 now. They, first, yeah, they it was like, all one, and then. They have various yeah. types. There's a, an advanced one called ChatGPT 5 Thinking. Yes. Which takes a lot longer yes. to respond because yeah. there's a more thorough response. So I finally was like, look, I want, I, I want some alerts. I want to do some tasks. So I wanted some information, and I wanted to keep it up to date. All I did was, for example, um, a certain company I wanted to follow, and I was waiting for a report. Uh, companies put out these 8Ks, and it talks about what's going on with the company at that moment. So I can never keep up. I'm not, how am I going to know when they publish? So I said, look, ChatGPT, uh, I want to set up a alert. If there's a new 8K released, let me know. And then I was like, and it, it just did it verbally, set it up. I was like, what? So then I said, okay. So I put in five other things that I wanted to do. And then what happened, though, this is what, where it got weird. It started doing its thing, and it sends you an email, and it also alerts your phone. There's settings in your settings where you can tell it to push email or toggle your phone. Okay, great. I was like, this is great. All of a sudden, though, it went bananas. Every hour. 24 7 it was sending me alerts uh, my email box got like this so i go on there and i'm like stop i don't want these alerts it says okay no problem i'm gonna stop the alerts okay great so five minutes later here they all come again i said look i told you stop this and it comes back says i purely understand everything i've got to stop it and it didn't no did it. so my I finally figured it out, and this there's no way, this is crazy, I'm only telling you this because now you might want to set something up, you can control it, but you have to go onto a desktop, go to your chat GPT, click your face, click notifications, and then there's a push, and then there is a, um, like a text thing or whatever. Way underneath is this tiny, tiny thing that says um, to stop. Like you, I didn't see it. I went there over and over and over. Like, I can't find it. Can't find it. Can't find it. Well, then you click it, and then it has all your alerts spelled out for you right there. And you can go up next to it and just hit delete, delete, delete. Piece of cake. Once you know what you're doing, 